All right, Frankie, we're in uh, still Whitestone. Cos... Coscaninos. Coscamin... Coscarimos. Coscarimos. One bite, everybody knows the rules. So, Coscarinos, brick oven pizza restaurante where every day is a Sunday. Uh, do you know what that means, Frankie, my Italian friend? Besides the fact every day is Sunday, do you know what that means? It's like Sunday dinner. There you go. I asked. I asked. I go, what does every day a Sunday mean? Because no offense. I don't want it to be a Sunday because that means the next day is Monday and then you like a schlep, you go back to work. But you have the big Sunday dinner, you do what you guys do, the Borellis, you sit around, you have your meatballs, your pizza, and you act like the Italians are the best people in the world. That's what you do. Frankie Muzzo, he'd say it, American now, Italians forever. This pizza looks exactly or well, very similar to uh, the, the place in Queens that we did, Amore. I like this style looking pizza, so we'll see how it tastes. And also, if we're being honest, I'm getting ready to go to a little place called Nantucket with the rich and famous go. I'm going to be gone for a month, so I'm jamming a bunch of pizza reviews in. That is like my 80th pizza today, so I'm starting to get full. Kids, do not try this at home. you got to be a professional pizza eater to do this. One bite, everybody knows the rules. Pretty good flop to cheese ratio. Let's see what we got. Very hot as well. Oh, wow. That oh, wow, was there's a tangy sauce on this, like a very distinctive cheese flavor. Good crisp, a little bit greasy. <laughs> what? Very tangy, right? Yeah, the sauce is sweet. The sauce is sweet. Very sweet. Sauce. Not cheap about putting the sauce of cheese on a, on a slice. Right? Yeah, no, they aren't cheap at all. Have you had a more? Yes. What do you think? Which one do you like more? About the same. We work here. Oh, Can't ask well, me. Work. We, <laughs> we, work, we work. We work here, but a more. I do like our pizza, too. though. Yeah, well, that would be good. I mean, guys, I saw you were sitting down. They weren't working that hard. They were sitting down eating when I was in there. Uh, they look the same. This sauce, the the sweetness would be an acquired taste for me. Not necessarily my cup of tea. It's too. It, it, I, I like it more traditional. But if you like the sweet sauce, and I mean very sweet sauce, I can see you loving this pizza. I'm gonna go six eight. It's good, but the sauce. It, it, that, that's an acquired taste. How sweet that sauce is. Like a lot of people say, Joe's has a sweet sauce. This is about 10x as sweet as Joe's. All right. Every day is a Sunday, Frankie. Every day is Sunday. Absolutely. All right. Absolutely. What do you think of your Mets, by the way? They're a disaster. No, we're not talking about them. Well, they're wearing, wearing, they're wearing the shirt. They're a disaster. They're more than a disaster. They should take their manager and put him on the Bad News Bears part two. Do you know? And he couldn't manage them. Mickey Calloway, <laughs> total disaster. Can't you just switch teams? Go get someone else. Take yourself out of the misery. Whose shirt are you wearing right here? Carlos, Carlos Beltron. Beltron. That's how deep the Mets fans got to go. Oh. This guy's wearing a Beltron shirt. I'm 62. I was I was there for the 69 championship, and I was at game six when the ball went through Buckner's legs. <laughs> Fuck you. I'm a Boston fan. No, but I love Boston. Because Why? Because I, I don't like the Yankees. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's true. There we go. We can agree on that.